The topology section under the geometry tab is used to edit existing topology or create new topology with the use of z-spheres. Let's look at edit topology first. If I have a model that is over 15,000 points, I can't edit that topology. So if I do press edit topology on a model like this, I get a message that it tells me that the mesh has more than 15,000 points and it asks me if I want to create a duplicate version of this mesh and use z remesher to reduce the poly count. Now, this takes into account the set value of the above slider k point count, which is this slider right here. It's usually set to 15, and what this does is it uses z remesher to reduce the poly count. So if I press yes, it starts the z remeshing process and it will z-remesh this as many times as it needs to create a mesh with less than 15,000 points so that we can edit the topology. Once it's finished, we get a duplicate, which is this guy right here, and we can start editing the topology of our new mesh. Now, to understand how you can edit the topology, best thing to do is come down to topology. If you over your mouse over this button and you press control, you get a, a list here of how you can control these points. So to add a point, you click on the desired spot. To delete a point, you alt click on a point, set a new starting point, you control click on the point and so on. So you can use this to find out how you can edit the topology. So I could remove some points here or and if I want, I could control click here and then go in there control click go in there okay so I'll just undo that but you alternatively you can do this manually you can just duplicate your sub tool come down to z remesh and z remesh accordingly as you like the z remesh button has some optimal settings and if I let's say five get it to five thousand points and I press z remesh it will z remesh below five thousand points when we have a result that we are happy with we can then use edit topology now that my poly count is lower than 15,000 points when I press edit topology I go straight into the po in topology mode now you also have this preview button and if you press it you see the topology you're ending up with you also have, have skin thickness but this is more useful when you're working with planes as you can see down here this geometry is closed so skin thickness is not really something you would use here now let's look at new topology if I press new topology I can start creating topology from scratch so I'll just do some topology here on the eye now if I press preview, all I get is this. It means that no topology is really set there. So what it means is that I need to connect these dots. So if I just quickly start connecting these dots, making perhaps quads, and this is the worst possible eye example that you could do, but here we have, now we have quads. You can use quads and triangles. Now if I press preview, I can see that I have some topology right here. And if I go press shift F to see my uh, polyframes, here is where skin thickness might be handy. So you can do it on the positive on on the negative. And now if I remove preview, once I unpress new topology, I get new topology just like that. 